Hello, everybody, and welcome to Cranky Crafters. We stream every Friday, every, well, except last week, but uh, every Friday at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. I'm your art bitch and producer, Patrick, and today we are working on mice and fish. I'll let the ladies tell you more about that. Hello, everybody. Hola. Ma, you need to adjust your camera angle. <laughs> There you go. All right. So we've got uh, we've got quite a people, quite a people. Yeah, we got quite a people. We've got quite a people. We've got quite a few people in the chat room already. Let's start with Joyce Meredith Green and Sandra. Hello, everybody. Laura Mac is here. Mark, Mister um, Potato. Mister, oh my God! I wish I was him. Mark Potato. Yes. Hello, Mark. How are you? His royal spudness. Yes. Don't forget Melon. Melon is here. Oh, wow. She was lucky enough to get Melissa, my mom, uh, uh, for her January flocker swap. Yep, and I sent yours out. It'll go out in the morning mail. Where's mine? You don't have a journal. Well, why the hell don't I? Yeah, why don't you? Because you never participate. You just push buttons. All right, I do push buttons, but I would participate if I had more time. Okay. Hello, Lolly Cunningham. How are you? Thank Hello, you Lolly. Us. So, um, I don't know about you guys, but uh, I've had one hell of a week. You know those? You know, you know when you work for a company that you love so much that you just want to cry every day when you're driving to work, and every day. You can just think about nothing more than drinking alcoholic beverages to get through the day. Because, again, that's how much you love the place. That's me. And uh, so I'm breaking my own rule. And, uh, yeah, I'm drinking. So if you guys want to just, like, thumbs down, right I understand. <laughs> uh, it, it, you know, now, I, I make a promise. I'm not going to say anything inappropriate today. Um, but I've just had that bad a week where I need alcohol to get through the suffrage. No, not suffrage, because that's eh. women voting. The <laughs> suffering of the week. <laughs> it's a Joel. A Joel. Janelle! Oh, Jonelle! How are you? Jonelle Bell. Yeah, she is actually our IRL friend. Hello, Jonelle. Like, we, we, we go drink with her every once in a while. She's fun. <laughs> She's, 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 uh, she might as well be a ginger at heart because she's just that cool. Uh, I love Janelle. She's awesome. I actually went over to her house not too long ago and I had to fix her internet. And didn't it, you also fix her sofa or something? Uh, no, I moved her sofa in. I had to remove two doors to get it in. I think two oh doors. Correct me if I'm wrong, Janelle, but I think I had to remove both doors. Um, but yeah, we moved her, her sofa in because it was about to rain. And uh, she had just bought a sofa and it just didn't fit. So yeah, that was me. Okay. Aw, Janelle says, I love you guys. <laughs> we're going out for Indian. We're going to Neil's place. Uh, over really? in Hunt uh Yeah, we're going to Neil's place in Putty Hill. No, not Putty Hill. Oh, oh I don't... White Marsh. What? No, not White Marsh. Janelle can key us into what town it is. It's not Hunt Valley. It's not White Marsh. It's not Putty Hill. It's Perry Hall. There you go. We're going to uh, Indian food at Perry Hall uh, next week. Um... It's amazing food. Mom, you've eaten there. What do you think of the food there? It's very good. I think Sanjay even liked it. Yeah. So we're going to be uh, going out with, with, with Janelle later uh, in the week. So, Carrie, mm. tell us, what the hell are you working on tonight? Well, this isn't what I'm working on. This is something I want to show and tell. Okay. Well, do tell. Uh... In the two orders of marabou sprays that I did, uh, I ended up losing one color both times, so... What is it, Peru? No, petrol. Petrol. And it was a P. It's a really pretty shade of blue, and I love blue, so I was not happy with the fact that I did not have said shade of blue. So I didn't want to go back to the same place because I feared it would just end up leaking again. And... uh 
went to Jerry's Artorama. Yay! Uh, who was also having a sale. Huh, love Why sales. didn't you tell me? <laughs> and, because we're leaders, not followers. <laughs> and uh, So lead, damn it! <laughs> and while I was there, I figured, well, you know, let me see if I can get it up to where it's free shipping. Which I was still short, but that's okay. Uh, Holy shit, this... little C is in the house. Sorry, back hey, to little you. C. Hey, little C. They had Hi, ginger. paper on this paper on sale that I had never seen before, and it caught my eye because it's rice paper, but uh-huh. it's coated with an emulsion made with seashell powder. Okay, wait, do tell. So I was like, huh, and I I tend to have a thing for paper so i want it to you don't at least say. try it now this pack is only five sheets but it, you it, it, it retails for like 22 bucks yeah it's usually oh my god yeah, it's usually like 22 23 dollars it was on sale for seven yeah oh you don't know these the, you see how big the paper looks it's literally that big it's it, 20 by 24 yeah so, <laughs> T says, "Fuck you." <laughs> oh, hello there, T. Hello, sassy T. So, I figured, what could it hurt to get it? Oh other my than god! If I actually really love it, then I'm gonna be paying out the ass. For it. Oh my god, that is amazing! But Look it, at the shimmer. It's, yeah, it's cool. got a nice shimmer because of the shell coating. But it's also got the look of like handmade paper, so it's really nifty. And apparently, it works well with most media, including watercolor and fluid acrylic. So it should no. be able to handle anything I throw at it. Okay, I have to interrupt this broadcast to let everyone know. Kim Kimmery, Kim Kimmery, Kim Kim Curry. That girl is as lucky as lucky can be. Sorry about that. Now back to the show. Hello, Kim. Marie. Hey, Kim Marie. Nicole is also here, by the way. Hello there, hey, Nicole. Nicole. And of course, Sassy <laughs> T. I'd, I'll have to get you squeaking. Oh, there, there you go. There she goes. All right. She's got that thigh gap going on, so it's actually more like... <laughs> okay, that, that, that suffices, yes. All right. Sandra says, damn, that was terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> Just think how it would be if you were live and in person. Yeah. CJ! 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 T says, play it, DJ, one more time. Kim Kimmery, Kim Kimmery, Kim Kim Curry. That girl is as lucky as lucky can be. Satisfied. Oy vey. <laughs> oh, yeah, you guys can continue with the show. Oh, uh, can we? Yeah, of course. Because somebody keeps interrupting. Hey, no, no, I'm not interrupting. T is interrupting. No, you are interrupting. Uh, only because T told me to. Oh, uh, T told you. I have to listen to her, otherwise she will kill me. Hey, oh, Matthias is here. Squirrel. What the hell happened here? Um, well, you and my father had sex, and nine months later I was born. That's what happened here. Oh. <laughs> Kathleen Elliott is in the house, hello. And I'm sure your mother's thinking, why did you have to remind me? Yeah, you know. Yeah, well, it happens. We all make mistakes. <laughs> Uh, yeah, but you, I mean, technically, I guess you were kind of that, but you're really the best thing I ever did, so. Well, thank you. <laughs> Is that, I bet you're only saying that because I do your IT support. <laughs> but then why isn't my website working? Because you <laughs> haven't put, uh, because you've been focusing on the freaking sidebar for a week. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no, because I can't figure it out. All right, well, I mean, maybe... IT support guy is like... Hey, no, you can't blame me. It's WordPress. You know WordPress. 
PJ, I have been so far <laughs> out of that loop for so freaking long. Yeah, what? Uh, you know, like you were complaining about your job. Well, that was the last three years of my job. Yeah, I know, but it's not. You don't. It's like riding a bike. It's like licking a lollipop. You don't forget where to lick to get the good taste. <sighs> yeah, you do. <laughs> hey, hey, what? Holly Dalton is in the house. <sighs> Well, hello. hello. And look who's here. Holly. Holly. This is Patrick. And Carrie. And Melissa. It's so nice <laughs> to have you back. Where you belong. I bet she's so glad to be back. Ah, you're looking swell, Holly. Hey, wait a minute. Oh, just something nice to say. <laughs> hello, Holly. <laughs> No one can see anything uh, because your your lower third is in the way. Don't blame my lower third for shit. Bite me. I would, but I've I, I'd end up with diabetes because you're so sweet. <laughs> what is Carrie doing? I have no freaking clue. Let's uh let's tune in to Carrie and see what she's doing. Carrie, what are you doing? Oh shit, she's got my jelly plate up. Well, um I am going to be working on adding a fish to this, but first I want to seal it, but I don't want to seal it until I've tested to make sure it's not going to screw it up. So, I have alcohol cuz it's alcohol inks on Yupo. So, Kim Marie wants to know. No fire? No fire. No fire. Okay. No fire. Not tonight. Um, <laughs> T I think I'd get too carried away. <laughs> T just gagged chunks. Ugh. And uh, CJ says, that's wrong, PJ. At our age, when we don't use it, we happily lose it. So there again, you're interrupting when you could wait till there's a lull in conversation <laughs> and then do what you just did. Oh, my God. Um... And then you wonder why I can't remember anything and why I choose not to talk half the time. Um, so I'm going to test it on this, which is vellum and alcohol ink. See if it'll not smear the ink everywhere and actually seal it. And then from there, we'll continue on. Okay. Now, run your mouth. I have nothing to run other than the fact that uh, Sandra needs a beverage. And uh, it, Matthias wants to let us know that uh, he hopes that we're feeling better. And uh, I'm still coughing up chunks of phlegm, um, but yeah, I'm feeling better. Carrie, uh, how are you feeling? Oh, I'm just freaking peachy. Yeah, she's peachy. And Nicole already smoked it. Because, you know, people are saying, fire, fire, fire! Fire in the hole! I've got my friend coming over tomorrow. It'll be nice to see him. That's all I'm going to say. Lucy, stop licking your butt. Lucy. Thank you. Apparently my camera for the dogs are not working. Well, nobody needed to see her licking her ass. I think Mark wanted to see it. I sincerely do. <laughs> Where is Mark? I haven't seen him chatting. Probably getting a tater. Hey, you know, Carrie and me can make some damn good taters. Like, I'm talking like western fries. They're good. It's not hard to do, dear. <laughs> T says, licking ass? PJ, quit! Why would I quit? Licking ass tastes so good. Oh, shit. <laughs> Oh <laughs> really? Yeah, of course, Ma. <laughs> T says, your mama's in the room. I taught him everything he knows. Exactly. Well, I taught him all the cuss words. Shit, piss, fuck, cut, cock, suck a motherfucker and tits. Should I, should I, should I not have said that? You need to chill the hell out. <laughs> Matthias says, I haven't had a good loaded baked potato in a long time. I don't know Why if you... Why the hell not? 
I don't know if you'd be up for the kind of loaded baked potato that Mark provides. Okay, nothing? No, because you're taking it too far. But that's what I do. Yeah, and what happened the last time you did that? People hated us because they, I said some words that I... Take it down a notch or two. But I'm not going to say words that I should not have said. Hope not. I have, I, I have, uh, you know, I have changed my, my filthy ways. Okay. Put some of the ink, but not too bad. That looks beautiful, honey. Utamas. Yes, <laughs> uh, Squirrel says, I was actually talking about the potato. And, and T, uh, you are correct. I did say that. And although I didn't mean it with any malice intended, uh, people, uh, pe people, people seem to think I did. And they no longer watch this broadcast. Which is fine by me. It's free country. Yes. Watch what uh, you want to watch. Exactly. Uh, Kimmery wants to know, what's to your left, Carrie? I think she's talking about that goop. This? Yes. It is oh. Liquitex Met Gel. Okay. Mel and I completely agree. She says, I thought we were all adults here. People may as well need to chill. I resent the fact that you think I'm an adult, no. <laughs> uh, Lolly says, I follow you on Facebook. Uh, who do you follow on Facebook? Uh, oh, oh, hello, Miss T. I hope you are doing better now. So I guess it's probably T she follows on Facebook. You know, we, we are on Facebook, too, you know. Yep, me too. Well, no shit, ma. <laughs> <laughs> That's some sticky stuff. Yes, it is. I'm just happy you're... F you, dear. There you go. That's the mama I love and adore. So, Ma, uh, tell us what you're doing with the Bernina. I am making uh, Dinky's Delights. I am making mice. Okay. And so all mice. of those who don't know who Dinky is, do explain. Oh, here. I show you who Dinky is. Hang on, Ma. Right. On a momento, I show you who Dinky is. On a momento, por favor. Do you have Facebook links? Uh, yeah, we can get you links. As a matter of fact, uh, that if... is Dinky. Mm. He's all right for a cat. Yeah, he's all right for a cat. He's my little <laughs> monster. T says it's a pussy. <laughs> it is. And he purrs like a freight train. I am giving out Facebook links to everyone involved with this stream. Doobie doobie doo. Carrie, you have the absolute hardest link to to My to verbalize. Need to be given out. Well, it's too freaking late, isn't it? I can't hear you. She muted, and then she still continues to talk. All right, there is everyone's Facebook accounts. We've got the Epiphany Craft Facebook account. We've got them, well, me Facebook account. We've got Carrie's and Mom's. T says, Carrie, what are you? <laughs> she also says, Achoo. God bless you. And yes, T, Dinky is a pussy. T? Or is she talking to Lil C? Something tells me she's talking to you. Oh. <laughs> Look at Carrie watching Mom. No, I'm reading the chat room. <laughs> 
Sandra wants to know, Ma, are you yes, doing yes. mice ears? Yes, these are little missy missy mice ears. They are adorbs. 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 Now I have to figure out how to turn them. Did I go buy more beads? Uh, see? <laughs> I don't think I need any right now. She, all right, let me, all right, let me, let me bring, let me bring up a, uh, a photo that Carrie posted on Facebook this week. And, um. I have one or two beads at my disposal. Yeah. Did you post that on the flock? Yep. Okay. I'm scrolling. Yep. I'm scrolling. There's so many awesome posts to scroll by. Here. I'll show you. Control everyone. F. Carry. Yeah, I know. There it is. All right. So this is 70 pounds worth of beads that Carrie has uh, procured from the, uh, the Goodwill web store at shopgoodwill.com. And uh, she has done so much work in the last three weeks. <laughs> Uh, like seriously, I'm not. I'm not being sarcastic. She has done so much friggin' work to get things as sorted as they are. It's still not perfect, but it'll do. Yes, it'll do. Yeah. Till I can't stand it, and then it'll get redone. Yeah. But for right now, it'll do. Oh, it looks like Lolly has uh, asked to join the flock. I am going to approve her. And. Art I bitch will needs to clean her. this and then when he gets a chance. Okay, well, uh, art bitch to the duty. Off. I cleaned some of it off. Well, you guys chat amongst yourselves, uh, you know, Carrie and Mom. But it has left a residue. Ha ha ha. Where's Mark when you need a good residue <laughs> joke? Hey, Malia is here. Hello, Malia. She's Hi, Malia. She is constructing 50 journals. Holy shit. Wow. So, do you think I have enough beads there, Miss T? I think I do. Until the next time I go trolling that website and see another <laughs> big package of them. Thank you, dear. Yeah. Yeah, that stuff is sticky. <laughs> sticky residue. <laughs> Oh, you need to still watch this. Watch out, Link. Link. That's my job. Your mother's there. They're not alone and unsupervised. <laughs> Jeez. Okay. All right. Oh, now I have to figure out how to turn this. And I forget where I saw it, whose stream it was. But they were monkeying around with baby oil and yeah. paper. Oh, shit. <laughs> Move that, please. What the hell is in there? Where? That's fine. Yeah. Better than getting my crap wet or third. <sighs> Thank you. Grumpy bitch. Don't make me move your shit. Don't be lazy. Wow. But anyway, if you take baby oil and rub it into paper you can make your own vellum hey nobody puts baby oil in the corner i can't hear your mother when you're yelling in my ear who needs to hear my mom <sighs> pj pj you might want to lay off the booze yep you're getting obnoxious I'm simply overcompensating for a freaking horrible week. 
Malia says it works with any oil. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, so you could use mineral oil or oblib oil. Oblib. Yeah, but baby oil smells better. That's very, very true, and it doesn't go rancid. Oh, no, baby oil does not go rancid, yes. <laughs> what are you laughing about? Oh, something that T said. T says, I'm going for it, but make sure the sticky isn't his manliness on the rim of your glass. Uh. He's sassy. And then she says, come on, that was funny. Gross, bad humor, and tacky, but funny as fucking hell. <laughs> yeah, pretty. Ooh, that is pretty. Holy crap. Oh, I like that. Is that that paper? No, this is... I don't know what the hell it's called, but it's, um... It's paper paper. It... it's works really well like when you get it wet because this is marabou sprays very cool and this is marabou yeah i just had it wet and sat here and kind of smeared it out the way i wanted it to while it was wet because i figured beauteous figured that would look all right as a beta fish which i <laughs> used my uh cricket maker and cut out a beta. Sandra says, that is fucking rad! Oh. And you know what I think is fucking rad? Hmm. Sandra's poppies. Look oh at them. Oh my god, they're gorgeous. Look at oh, that. I mean, wow. holy shit, how do you do that? They turned out so fantastic. You they're guys, pretty. Sandra does a live stream every once in a while, and it is definitely worth the watch. So if, if you guys, like, don't subscribe to Sandra... Like, you really need to, and as a matter of fact, because of that, I'm actually going to post it in the chat. So, go subscribe to that link right there that I've posted, because well worth it. I'm still thinking we need to get Sandra on a live episode sometime. Cricket? What? What? I think that would be a great idea. Yeah, but everyone's just like silent now. Oh, because I'm trying to match up parts. You really can't see what the hell heck I'm doing. Well, no, but that's because you got the Bernina in the way. Well, I'm using that. I'm using um, my face cam so you can see what I'm doing on the machine. But I'm not doing anything on the machine right now. I hear you. I don't know how much of this I'm able to uh, divulge on the on the stream, but Sandra's working on a. Uh, Wizard of Oz necklace, and I've seen some of the beads she's going to use for it. Holy shit. Amazing. Oh, re yeah, really good stuff, but hey, here's a fun fact. We still can't hear you. Fucking mute switch. Yeah, that you pushed with your foot. Oh, wow. Well. Oh, it's supposed to be horribly cold tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was driving in Philadelphia, PA this afternoon, and uh, there's signs all over the road saying, winter warning. Winter storm warning, yeah. Yeah. And when I, I was following you on Google, <laughs> yeah. it was saying that. Oh, wow, really? Yeah. Yeah, it's basically saying commercial vehicles banned from traveling on 476 and 276 and 295 and all of this. Basically, go the hell home. Yeah, pretty much. Hey, I'm not on call this weekend, so I don't care. My van is still at the office, though, so I should really try and, you know, like, take Carrie over there and pick it up. Yeah. Because it's been there for like a week and a half now. Oh, has it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
Well, I mean, they gave me a work vehicle, so I'm, like, driving that around and taking that home. Well, it might behoove you to leave it there a little longer. What, in case they fire me or um, in case I quit? Yep, that way you'll have a ride and I won't have to come get you. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking that the other day. Oh, man. You yeah, know, I was thinking that on Wednesday when I thought I was about to get fired, but in, it, it was just a, a case of my boss's multiple personalities. Holy Keep crap. Ginger oh. says we're supposed to get up to 18 inches. Christ. Oh well, I heard up in New England they're calling for like 40. Oh, shit. Uh, we, we, oh, yeah, yeah. My, my Lumna Acres, he's supposed to get hammered. Oh. He's in northern New Hampshire. Yeah, um, my my friend Mark, my brother Mark, he is uh, he is in Nor New Hampshire as well, and we should probably go pick him up. Yeah, <laughs> it's only a ten hour drive. He has a vehicle. He starts now. He'll be all right. Yeah, Sandra's got a uh, a gripe about the chat room. She says, "Where the heck did everyone go?" It says there's twenty two people in here, but nobody is talking. I don't know. I think maybe you need to refresh. Cause... Dirty paintbrush. Hey. Hey, Hello. dirty paintbrush. paintbrush. I'm so bad with names. I don't know her or their she real told name. Me, but I don't. Kim. 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 Okay. Hello, Kim. Oh wow, Ginger's in Vermont. Well, Ginger, be safe. All right. I am going to. I get the glue off of the thing on the bob. We'll see how far I get before I decide all hope is lost and I don't know how to sew. I mean, I already know I don't know how to sew. <laughs> You've been sewing for more years than I've been alive, Ma. I know, I know. There's no decent excuse for that. I can quilt like there's no tomorrow, but don't ask me to make stuff like this. Well, you're the one who decided to make it. I know, I know, I know. Because I adopted Dinky, and then I said, well, Dinky needs toys. And Well, why couldn't I sell toys? I could make Dinky's little delights, and every cat in, in the world would want my toys. They would all want a Dinky. Yeah, quite possibly. I know so, Carrie likes a dinky every once in a while. That's a, <laughs> that's a freaking lie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right, now how does this work? It's a sewing machine, don't you know? Uh, no, I'm coming to a three-point turn here. and <laughs> Go straight. Got to make sure all the parts are where they belong. Aw, Bootsy says, uh, that's Roy, right? Hi, yeah, that's Roy. Hello, Hi, Roy. Roy. See, I remembered you. That means I really like you. Uh, anyway, uh, he says, uh, y'all must be very special to me since I'm in Fort Lauderdale on vacation and couldn't stop myself from tuning in. Maybe I need to go back into therapy. Thanks, Melissa, for asking about my hand. You're welcome, sweetheart. I love all my flockers. I care about each and every one of you. Uh, especially when I know one of them's hurt, and that really breaks my heart. Yeah. I mean, I, I really hope that, uh, what is it, carpal tunnel, right? Mm. Yeah, I really hope that that uh, heals up quite well, because, man, if I couldn't work with my hands, that would kill me. So, get well soon, Roy. Yeah, he says he's doing real good, so good, that's good. good. 
So yeah, sometimes that surgery is a necessity. Uh, is a necessity. Yeah. I'm. I've been lucky, except for my back. Like like today, I've I've been on my feet for like ten hours, and my feet are freaking. Or my back is killing me. It's compressed as hell, and my rib cage is just screwed up. And uh, but other than that, I have no complaints. Well, no, I always complain. All right, yeah. let me rephrase. I really am. I'm. I'm I, I don't have it that bad off. You know, I have a mechanical keyboard, and I don't have carpal tunnel because of it, and so, yeah. But, um, yeah, that's gotta suck. Alright. T says, put your finger under the needle to guide it. Uh, T... Under the needle? Yeah, you, you, you really shouldn't be advising thing? people for, for that. Like, that step in the, in, in the process is not necessarily a good thing. Yeah, I wouldn't need to be told to do that. I would do that all on my own. Yeah, just like you burn yourself when you cook dinner. But yep. holy love, crap, that's a huge I, pair of scissors. I love these scissors. They are my gingers. They are fabric scissors. They've never seen paper. And death will befall anybody that shows paper <laughs> to these scissors. Yeah. Let, I mean, listen to the sharpness. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, I like that. They're probably as old as you. <laughs> uh, T says, I meant by the needle. I didn't come out right. Sorry! Mm -hmm. She also says, PJ needs stickers that says broken, confused, and used. Mm -hmm. That's actually perfect. If you want to have them printed up and sent my way, I will post them and stick them everywhere. Okay, let's turn this. In the side out. Fuck it, fussy cut. You know, you have a scanning cut, honey. Yeah, and the time it would take me to figure out how to get that thing to cooperate. I will have already cut this freaking Wait, she's out. got a cricket maker. Yeah, but that doesn't cut. No, it well, cuts, it, doesn't it doesn't scan, scan. and cut. So, Carrie, what are you working on? I've already discussed this. Yeah, for the new people in the chat room. They should have been here on time. I agree. <laughs> but say it again just anyway. I am... Um... <laughs> okay, and you can continue right along. <laughs> Yeah, T says, she is make-a-fish. Is that like make-a-wish? Wait, is someone dying? Aren't we all? Well, yes, but at different paces. Ouch. What did you do? I got a shock when I sat down. So you see this here? It's stuff. denim foam, uh, denim fabric, yes. Yes, this is what comes inside your home chef box. I am aware. But not the people may not be. <laughs> they may be curious as to where I got this unusual batting. So I am telling them. Ah. It comes from your home chef delivery box. Yes, it does. And I gotta say, Carrie made the most amazing chicken dinner tonight. Home chef? Yes. Home chef oh, it was. What recipe it be? It was a recipe of, uh, it was, uh, chicken with, uh, uh, shit, I'm losing my words. It was, uh, squash. What kind of, uh, what kind of, Ac yeah. acorn? No, it was butternut squash with oh. feta cheese and walnuts. Oh my God, that sounds good. And then chicken. It was so good. So I'm just pulling this apart and all this is, is ground up jeans. Just ground up jeans. That's all it is. 100% cotton. And it's very soft. And it's safe for kitty. But I doth not have no catnip. Yeah. So. Kim Marie says, that does sound yummy. Mm. 
Hey, Kimmery, if you want, I will send you a free box of uh, of of, yep. of Home Chef. It is delicious. I can do that too. I also have a forty dollar gift card. Well, isn't that nice? To send somebody. All right, so I'm just putting some stuffing in it. I'm stuffing the mouse. <laughs> T says, look at you, Kimmery, getting some foodie in your belly. Well, yeah. What? Well, T uh, T says, "Oh, they love you, Kim Marie. Well, we love you too, Kim." Uh, uh, mm -hmm. T, I'm losing. I'm sorry. When I get really stressed out and have had a really bad day, I lose my words. So that's kind of what happens. Um, I digress. Um, we love you too, T. So if you want, uh, let us know, and we'll send you a uh, a gift box of uh, of of uh, um, yeah. Home Chef, that's the word. T says, no one loves tea. It's awesome. Well, it's less awesome because we love you. I had shrimp scampi last night. I wanted to order that, but I'd be the only one eating it. No. Well, all right. Not. No, Carrie and me would be the only ones eating it. Jamie does not do shrimp. Uh, okay. Jamie is our son. For all of those who don't know. <clears throat> As a matter of fact, anyone who wants a uh, free box of uh, Home Chef, just like, you know, hit me up on Facebook. I just need your email address and I'll hook you up. And mom can too. Yep. Because we both are subscribers. And they give us free perks like, hey, giveaway boxes. Did you notice a lighting change? No, I did not. Oh, the light the light got bright all of a sudden. Interesting. I'll have to I'll have to play with that um what you told me. Yeah. Hey, Grin and Ferret, what's up? Hello there, Grin and Ferret. Oh. You look like you're abusing that thing. What? <laughs> You're just, like, sticking holes in it and stuff. Where? You! Me? I'm not... I'm just <laughs> stuffing the stuffing in. <laughs> You're probing Poking it. Poking holes in it? You're probing it! It's not a voodoo... There it goes again. <laughs> it's not a voodoo mouse. Is it a wireless voodoo mouse? No. Oh, all right. Carry on. Malia says she's trying to get information from it. From what? I have no idea. Ah, Roy says we we re <laughs> we received a free trial for Blue Apron. It was fun, but we love to cook and experiment, so it wasn't for us. Yeah, we were going to get from Blue Apron, but they just didn't have enough for us. They only had like five meals to choose from, and you can only get three at a time or something like that. It was really stupid. Uh, and you know, because we have three people in the house, they didn't have serving for three. They had two, and it's like. It's did they, did they have four? I don't think they do. It's kind of I strange. don't remember. Uh, <laughs> T says, PJ, give the box to Sandra, please. Share the nice, not the lice. Well, we'll give you one and Sandra. I don't care. Just give me your email address. Or I can just pull it up. If you, you know, like Sandra and T, I think I've got your email addresses. So just let me know that you're interested. Yeah, Malia says, Blue Apron has awesome junk mail, though. Mm. Well, yeah, if you can turn it into something beautiful like art. That's what I'm doing here with this here insulation. Yeah. 
Hey, T says, I might be scared of you. Yeah, like I said, Roy, we were going to go with uh, Blue Apron, especially since one of our favorite uh, podcasts, uh, the Burt Cast from Burt Kreischer, um, he is, uh, you know, he's he's got a sponsor deal with them, and we were going to use him to get like fifty dollars off our first meal or whatever, or first box or whatever. But they just they just did not have the selection we wanted, and the stuff that they did have looked really weird, like. There's good weird, and then there's like, what the fuck is that weird? And it was like, what the fuck is that weird? So we just, yeah, whatever. I actually uh, opted for one of the lunches this Ooh, week. Really? How is it? I haven't tried it yet. Um, what is it? Uh, oh, wow. I can't remember. Let me log on to the website and I'll find out. Um... I can't even find my keyboard. That sounds like a personal problem. There it is. Okay. What did I get? Let's see. What did I order? Order history. Show us on the screen, huh? Just a minute. All right. Um, Pork egg roll in a bowl? No, that's not what I got. That's the wrong. That's the wrong week. Ah, here, January 11th. And they keep, <laughs> they keep giving me free stuff. What? Really? Yeah, because I complain about stuff and they, you know, and they say, well, you know, and I, I sent her an email last night and I said, I just wanted you to know that everything was really good um, for last week, um, except for the sad looking tomato. Oh, yeah. Uh, but, but this week the shrimp came and it was opened, but it only, oh. I said, I, oh, I'll give you a credit. I said, no, I don't want a credit. I said, I'm just letting you know. You know, it didn't spoil anything else. It was just juice in the protein bag. But oh, um, that, that happens sometimes with the chicken. Yeah. So uh, I had I had the garlic uh, shrimp scampi last night, and then today for lunch. And this is uh, this is the Thai peanut steak salad. Oh, that's the lunch. That's a lunch. Yeah, oh, seven ninety nine a person. That's cheap. So I order. Yeah. Is so it I big? Got that. Is it a big I serving? Don't, I, I don't know. Okay. Um, I haven't made it yet. Um, and then I got the sherry wine demi glace sirloin steak. We've had that before, and it was really good. It wasn't sherry; it was uh, Madeira, I think. But we we tried that; it was really good. They have, they seem to have a nice steak option every week. Yeah, they've got so, good sirloins. Um, yeah, you know, they do. Except mine have been different sizes, and I told her that I would let her know because that was one of my major complaints from the Atlanta distribution um place that i was getting you know mismatched steaks yeah so one was shoe leather and one was raw yeah well i i yeah well, it is what it is um yeah. and it, then i got mojito rubbed bone in skin on chicken oh wow i don't think we've gotten that we got the bone in, we got the parisian bone in chicken and it was fantastic was uh, it yeah no it really was it really was good uh t says do you get to choose t there are 14 yes. and i don't know why we're spending so much time talking about this cuz they're not a sponsor of cranky crafters but they they well, here let's look at this you get to choose 14 different options per week week see now here this is my January 23rd basket. Yeah. And I've chosen these four items, which is steak moutarde with roasted sweet You can't potato say potatoes. that, Mom. Stop it. <laughs> uh, pork egg roll in a bowl. Teriyaki chicken thighs with smoked almonds. And a barbecue beef mini, mini meatloaf. Nice. But you can, you can um, let's see, I can't change that at this point. Yeah. Because it's Friday, but this is for the 30th, and these are the things that I've picked so far. Cheddar crispy potato crusted chicken, oh. jalapeno popper burger, arroz con polo with chicken thigh, 
and Marsala mushroom gramili bake. Nice. But there's 14 additional options. Yeah. Well, not 14. I don't think 14 more no, options. It says 14 more great meal options. Well, I see what it says. So you can have a premium meal, which is uh, lamb chops. I have so uh, we saw that the other day, and Carrie's like, "I've never had lamb," and I'm like, "Oh, I love lamb." I, I really wanted to get it too, but see, they they give you the option of picking a premium meal, but it's more than ten dollars a serving. It's usually like twenty dollars a serving. Yeah, it's nineteen ninety five a serving. Yeah, but it's so worth it. I'm guessing. Yeah, we've done it once, and it was good. Yeah, it was really yeah. good. So there's. Yeah. Plenty of other options, and their their quick lunches are fantastic. Have you tried any of them so far? No, I, I got that one that I uh, maybe I'll make that tomorrow. Um, I'll, but I have to I have to go go look. You know how long the other things will last for. But um, citrus chicken salad, prosciutto, apple, and cheddar sandwich. Oh man! Uh, Greek chicken pasta salad with feta and tomato, and they also offer seasonal fruit and a smoothie. Yeah, I've never so, gotten the seasonal fruit or a smoothie because it doesn't seem like a really good bargain. Yeah. Um, oh, fish and chips. Oh, yeah, we're we had. I think we had that. No, we're getting. Oh, we're it. getting it. Yeah, we're getting oh, that. Tilapia fish and chips. Yeah. Roast, roasted potato wedges and tartar sauce. Yeah. And everything is just raw ingredients. Now, sometimes they will give you like teriyaki sauce or demi glaze or yeah. demi glace um, that is pre you know pre prepared. But everything is just raw ingredients. And you so they say, and the, I tell you, the instructions they give you once you realize the format is fluid, it's just so easy to follow along with. Yeah. Yeah, so I really, I really enjoy it. I have to, I have to cancel like the twentieth. I have to skip because I'm going up to New York that week. Oh, are you? Okay. Yeah, I have to go to the doctors. Gotcha. So. But anyway, so that is that is Home Chef in in a nutshell. Yeah. And uh, yeah, for us this uh, this next week, we're getting uh, the wood fired barbecue chicken pizza, the baked French onion penne, the pork egg roll in a bowl. That's what, yeah, I'm getting that too. Yeah, and the pork chop are <laughs> And uh, yeah, I, I, I gotta say, like, we've been doing these guys for like, oh, I don't know, like, I don't know what, four three, three or four months now. And uh, we loved it so much. We talked to mom and we gave her a free, you know, we sent her a free box and she ended up loving it. Now she does it every week. And I tell you what, it's for four. We have the four meal plan, which is uh, four servings, four meals. And it's $160 a month, like clockwork a week. Uh, um, a week sorry. Thank you, Carrie. Um, it's $160 a week. And if you look at it, you go into the grocery store and you get all this stuff to make all this stuff and it's going to be about 160 anyway. And we don't have to deal with people at the grocery store that are me monsters and dealing with, you know, Oh, I want, I want, I want. And it's like, fuck you. <laughs> I want to, you're not the only one in the world. Um, but we, so we don't have to deal with that. We do go to the grocery store for like, I don't know, paper towels, tampons, toilet paper, toothpaste, you know, the, the necessities. And I think sooner or later, we're going to end up going to, um, Amazon for that. Cause I, 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 well, I'll let Carrie explain it to you, but, um, we hate the grocery store. We really do. Carrie. What? I uh, really want to talk about it. Talk. I'm done talking. Well, don't volunteer me. <laughs> well, I, you know, I, I threw the camera on you because we wanted to see the fish, but I also wanted to hear you talk about your point. I just, I don't like people. No. I don't want to have either. to stop when I get off of work. I want to come home. I don't want to have to go there and deal with that. I don't want to have to waste my time when it is my time on the weekend to go and do that. Yeah. But, you know. Is what it is. Uh, yeah, I I still have to go to Walmart though, because you know I need I need the 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 breakfast food, you know, the yogurt and the milk and the yeah coffee yeah. creamer, and I need Rosie's food and yeah and uh, East food. Yeah. Speaking of, Ginger wants to know: Do they do breakfast? No, they do not. They do smoothies. They do smoothies and fruit. 
which is considered breakfast, I guess. But they don't do a formal breakfast. Like, you can't get bacon and eggs from them. I don't think eggs would make it through the shipping process. No. As a matter of fact, as we've been doing it for four, three, four months now, and we have never gotten eggs. So. Uh, how much is in a free box, T wants to know. I think it's three meals? Okay, uh, Ma, we, when we sent you the free box, how many meals came in it? You didn't send me a, three, a free box. You sent me a $30 coupon did i okay well yes oh well you, would have to you never sent me a box. yeah if janelle is still in the chat room we did send her one of those free boxes and she did take a you know take take them up on the offer um so you'd have to ask janelle i don't know if she's still here but it's it, it's at least a full meal or three so and like I said, if you want to post your email address in the chat room, or if you want to send a Facebook message to me with it, uh, you can do that, and I'll go ahead and send you out a, th uh, a, f a free box. Uh, it's a $30 credit, so that's uh, $10 per meal for the regular meals. So that's you know a three-serving meal or a single-serving three meals. I can They math. don't do single-serving. All right, well, it'd be a serving and a half. A meal and a half. Yes, that too. But, yeah, I really like um, Home Chef. I've seen a lot of other competitors out there. And, you know, I'm, I'm interested to check them out. But I'm not too interested because I got to tell you, I think there's been, out of the four, three, four months that we've been doing uh, Home Chef, there has been, like, I think one meal that we just didn't like. And I can't even remember what it was, so it wasn't, it must have been not that bad. Yeah, I mean, I've had problems, um, but that's the Atlantic distribution. Yeah. If you guys Place. live near Atlanta, Georgia, and are a few hours from Atlanta, you might want to... Yeah. But they constantly, oh my God, you know, all you do is send them a quick little email and boom, they take care of it. Yeah, they're really good about that. Right. And again, I don't know why we're spending so much time talking about Home Chef because they're not a sponsor. I still need a wee bit more. I need to stuff his little bottom. Um, wow. There we go. The mouse! <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's still baggy. I dropped it. Carrie made some salmon yesterday that was so good. Was that from Home Chef? Oh, yes. I haven't it was, tried it was this. salmon yet. Hot honey salmon? It was so freaking good. That sounds good. Yeah. I mean, yeah, see, that, that tomato is bullshit. <laughs> the tomatoes that I get are pale. <laughs> ours ours were like that... Exactly yeah. like that. Ours were... You they don't looked, know. I don't know, but I've cooked enough meals from them. Your ass wasn't even home. Yeah, yeah, I am aware of that, because I've been working 12-hour friggin' days. Well, just get your paycheck and shush. Yeah, well. But, uh, no, the salmon was so good last night. And then tonight, oh my god, it was so good. What'd you have again? Butternut squash with feta cheese and walnuts. Oh, yeah, and chicken. And chicken. I'm trying to actually get a piece of... Uh, I'm, I'm trying to get a picture of it. But I don't really know where the hell it is. Look in your orders. I'm doing that. Bite me. Why would I bite you? Okay. All right, he's a little saggy in his 
buttocks. I don't get it. It doesn't show up on our order history. Oh, there it is. It's rosemary cream chicken with walnut and feta acorn squash. Oh, well, it was acorn squash. I don't know. Okay, so it wasn't butternut squash. I just cooked squash. the crap. I don't know. Yeah. But this is what we had, and it really did look just like this. It was amazing. And I owe that to Carrie, because Carrie, like, I, I worked until 6 o'clock, 6 30. No, 7 o'clock. I don't what are you doing no, wait. There? You what? got home at 6. I got home at 6. Okay. Um, but I started my day at seven, so. <laughs> what but, What are you doing up there? Are you opening up like a new new branch or something? Or? Yeah, yeah. There's a new store that's opening up on the twenty fourth. So I was in there making sure that the gas, uh, you know, the gas price sign worked, and make sure the time clock worked, and making sure that everything else works. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you were running around again, T. <laughs> T says, I hear squeaking. Yep. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, they send us all of these ingredients as 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 you see it. Yep. And uh man. And they the the little um like the cooking wine and um some of the other ingredients come in very, very like useful. This. Yeah, <laughs> containers. So all you have to do is wash them out. They're they're <clears throat> machine washable, dishwasher safe. Wash the freaking things out and take them to your craft room. Yeah, that's what Carrie is doing. I think that was Parmesan cheese or something that was in there, something like that. It was a liquid. Okay. Powdered yeah, cheese is going. This back. was marinara sauce from Home Chef. Uh, you're pointing to the wrong camera. There yeah. you go. Yeah, there you go. You can see marinara. See, I pull the stickers off. Oh, they're stickers? Mm -hmm. I thought they were etched on. Mm -mm. They're stickers. Oh, mm. it is a sticker. Yeah, I haven't bothered. Well, peel that shit off, Mama. <sighs> but then I won't know what's in there. Well, it's not marinara, so you can lay that to rest. But I did put it in the marinara <laughs> jar. So I know. All right. So I want to talk about something. Carrie had uh, mentioned that uh, uh, that you know she's been working on trying to organize the seventy pounds of uh, beads and crap she got from Goodwill, and uh, that has been a really long experience. It's taken her about what three or four weeks to actually it sort through three it. Three or four weeks. It was three weeks. It was three episodes of Prime. How about that? Prime. Prime? Oh, wow. Okay, three episodes of Cranky Crafters. Shit. Prime was the old no, podcast we used two. to do. Almost two and a half. Whatever. <laughs> Moving along. Yeah. So, um, but now that that's done, Carrie and I are going to sit down and uh, start making a list of uh, ideas for production videos for Epiphany Craft Studio, which is our other channel on YouTube. On the YouTube. Yes. And uh, that, that, that means we will start producing videos again on uh, the channel that I mentioned just a second ago. And uh, that's a good thing. So, can't wait to get that started. I've got some new camera gear that I'm willing, uh, that, I, that I'm really, really, yeah. <laughs> Kim Marie says, finally! <laughs> uh, she's been bitching at us for so long. But, uh, yeah, I've got, uh, I've, I've actually got some new camera gear that I'm, I'm really itching to try out. Uh, it's gonna really add some uh, new dimension to our production. It's actually 4K video. So, really excited about that. I guess the users would be excited, too, if they're watching on their televisions. Yeah, well. Hey, I turned it. <laughs> <laughs> what did you turn? I had, to, I had to turn. I took this. It's and adorable. It inside out. Now i got to foof it out. It's the ear, so as soon as I have it 
Well, sit your sit your I'll show it to you. Kim Marie says, "Whoa, there, Sparky! Bitching is a bit harsh. Harsh, don't you think?" She was gently nudging. <laughs> Oh, oh, it's so cute. It's a little ear. <laughs> Mark says, OMG, you made me a stuffed potato. It's not a potato. It's a mouth. <laughs> <laughs> and T supposedly thinks I have demons. Why do you think I have demons, T? How dare you? I mean, you're right, but how dare you anyway? Come on, tuck all your little bits in. That's what she said! <laughs> <laughs> CJ wants to know, Melissa, are you yes, adding catnip before closing your mouse up? No, this is just a test run. I don't have any catnip yet. Well, come on. They I must have... sell it on Amazon. Oh, I know they do. I just haven't. I just thought I was... <laughs> I've been wanting to do this for a couple of days. And uh, I'm just doing a trial run to see if it works. And if it does work then we will um, order catnip and we will start producing them. Ah. But I need a website that works first. Here, I stick it on here and show you. Don't even start about the website. Your website works plenty fine. No, it doesn't. What's not? Well, what doesn't work about it? Uh, the whole thing. Well, whose fault is that? Yours. Yours. Excuse me? Hey, wait a minute. Why are you ganging up on me, Carrie? That's my job. You shouldn't <laughs> be siding with Mom. You should be siding with I'm me. Not, PJ, stop. I'm not ganging <laughs> up on you. I was not talking to you, Mother. <laughs> I just, I don't want to have to deal with this back-end bullshit anymore. I really don't. Well, if you'd come up with the freaking content, I would help you do the rest. Can you can you can you come up with the content? Yeah, I have plenty of content. Okay, we'll make it. I'll take care of the rest. You do the content. I need to know where to put it, and how to put it, and like all these fucking shipping things. Oh my god! <laughs> shipping zones, shipping methods. Oh, for fuck's sake! All right. Classes. All you need to know is this: in WordPress, if you're going to make a uh, if you're going to create a page that is for static content, it's a page. If you're I'm going not. to, I know that. Then do it. If you do it, they will PJ. come. Mother, I'm talking about the menus, the, the overall layout. I have been beaten on the thing all fucking day, and I can't get it to do what I want. Okay. Tell me what you want, all in a in, in a well executed email, and I will help you. I can't guarantee it'll be soon, but I will help you as soon as I can. And and Mark says, "OMG, WordPress, crap, crap, crap." Well, what would you WordPress suggest? WordPress multi user. Well, yes, it's a multi site install. Cause fishy. Fishy. Ooh. Oh, I love that. Holy That's shit. Oh I'm my darken, god! I would darken all the edges so they all all the different parts stand out. That, yeah, yeah, I will once, she, yeah. once I get it attached. <laughs> T says she married you for Melissa, Art bitch. We all know this. <laughs> yeah, I know it too. Don't need to rub it in. Although, wait. Really? <laughs> okay, I have. Well, Roy, if you have questions about WordPress, just let me know. WordPress is definitely not crap. It's just confusing as shit. But, My uh, issue is not with WordPress because I understand how WordPress is. 
I understand static pages and posts and all of that. What what throws me is all of this shit piled on top of WordPress and this themify thing because there's five different places to change the same freaking thing. Yeah, and, and that's not WordPress. Find, that's that's yes, freaking and themify. themify. And I cannot find where to go to get what I want. All right. Well, you tell me everything that you want me to fix, and I'll fix it. But you got to be you. You got to put it in an email. Okay. And I will. I will help you. I It'll promise. It'll take me ten fucking hours to write the email. Well, whose fault is that? I just want to <laughs> talk to you over the phone, and then you can tell me where to go to do this. All right, how about this? You tell me what you want me to do, and I'll do it. Because I can't tell you how to do stuff if I have to look it up. Because I, it's just as hard for me as it is for you. Do you see what I have to deal with, people? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Carrie. <laughs> I need to go to my safe space now. Yeah. Oh, uh, paintbrush says that is effing gorgeous. Well, thank you. Yeah, thank it you is gorgeous. Much. Oh, my back hurts. You too, huh? Yeah. Mark funny. says that looks like a potato with fins. Oh, finger is too much. Oh. But when. You My God! Hold it at certain levels. You can see where that stuff. Yeah. It's hitting it in some places and not in others, and it really does make it look like coral now. No, it really does. That's all. Oh, you need, all right. I'm gonna show this a lot. Yeah. All right. Let me get the mic in front of me so you guys can hear me. Hello, everybody. Carrie just brought this over to my bay, and I thought I would show you you guys can't see the coral that, effect it, that's going I on i can see the coral no you really that can't is believe me you can't it it's doesn't show up on camera like texture now. yeah let's see if we can get in real close uh down boy don't tell me which way to point i know where the coral texture is all right stop moving it so fast very cool. It has to be moved fast, or you don't get the uh, the, the the proper viewpoint. Oh, Honey, that is amazing, and I love you, and I bow I down to you. Yes, we need to get a five by seven frame. We will go to Walmart this weekend and see if we can get it. World. Yeah, a five by seven. Mark says this is why you should have left him under the cow patties, Melissa. Uh, you know, I know, but he was so cute, I couldn't. Yeah, but I smelled like cow patties. Yeah, well, that's what baby powder is for. Uh, babies are supposed to smell perfect right out of the uh, bat. No, they smell like barf and poop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I still smell a little bit like barf and puke. No, it's more of a... Uh, Methane. Fecal. Fecal matter. Barf and poop. Oh, the farting. Yeah, I do fart a lot. All right, there is ear number two. And, you know, speaking of getting people on the show to do a live stream, I'd love to get Mark on the stream. Mark and Roy. And T. And Kimmery, because they're both amazing. Good luck getting Kimmery. I like know. teeth. I know. She's as bad as you when yep. it comes to being social. I think I need Very to, cool. I think I need to do something to glitz up the back fins. Yeah, it, I would. I would go around the outline of all the pieces very lightly, so you can see them. Ma'am. Hey, I'll take this moment to uh, let you guys know that we do have a call in line. Yes, that's right. If you've always wanted to call in and be a part of the stream, you can actually do so by calling four ten. 989-1734. Hello, color. You're live on Cranky Crafters. Because, <laughs> you know. Dry wow, T. Separate your crack, swipe, wipe, and do it twice. See, my motto <sighs> is you wipe until white. Yeah, no, I wipe three or four times. And it's, but what if you're not white? 
then I keep wiping. <laughs> and it's not that is that you know he is probably the only male that well only male that I know of that his underwear doesn't look like a, a, he hit a deer or something. Because um, I wipe. Yes, but he's also full of very hot, noxious, putrid smelling gas that is on a time release valve. <laughs> so it, it kind of gets to, that gets to be a bit much, although it typically does make me giggle because he always complains, God damn it. I'm the guy, I'm the one male that I know that farts like crazy, but does not like the fact that I fart. <laughs> like other guys are like, ha that was funny. No, I hate it. I don't like being a farty fucker. A farty fucker. I do not like it. Yes, Kim Marie, no skin marks. Well, I can't get free of this house. any more on this until I get afraid. Um, Alright, where the heck is my... Oh, let's roll over here and see what we can find. T just says panty fireworks. Okay, here is. So I've got some bad news. Oh. And this 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 might not affect everybody, but um. Uh, Ma, you know the guy, uh, you know the band uh, Walk Off the Earth, right? No. Yeah. Is it Walk Off the Earth? Yeah, Walk Off the Earth. I thought it was Walk the Earth. No, it's Walk Off the Earth. Oh, Uh, You know the beard guy, the keyboard player? Yes, I love him, yes. Yeah. Um, On July, on on July, what the fuck? On December 30th, um, he, uh, he died in his sleep at 51 years old. Oh my god, what yeah. happened? Uh, natural causes. Uh, th- that's all they're saying right now, but Mike Taylor, the known as Beard Guy, from the band Walk Off the Earth, uh, who's a very, very well-known band out in Canada, but they're, they're the guys who did, like, you know, five guys, one guitar on YouTube. They're, they're like a viral sensation. Um, but, uh, yeah, he, he died of natural causes on uh, the 30th. And uh, they they've um, they've decided to go on to their 2019 tour without him uh, because it's what they what he would have wanted. And, uh, you know, so they're 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 continuing on without him. But it's very sad. And uh, they did a tribute concert on uh, CBC, which is a Canadian TV uh, network. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we we just found out the other day and I was like, oh, my God. That's sad. That really is. He 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 was fantastic. Yeah, I mean, he played piano. He played accordion. He played pretty much every instrument you could think of. He was a multi instrumentalist. Um, but if you guys if you guys know Walk Off the Earth, you know that he was a huge part of the band. And uh, it's it's a shame that he died, and it, it totally took Carrie and me off guard because like we loved the band. We lo- like he was our favorite member of the band. Um, I just, uh, it's, it's a shame. It's sad, but, um, yeah, he, uh, he, he died. Wow. That is sad. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. T said, boy, that was depressing. Thank you, PJ. Yeah. I'm sorry, T. Debbie Downer. I mean, hey, if you gotta go, go in your sleep. That's like the best way to go. But yeah, seriously, like Grandpa. Yeah, yeah. Grandpa went. Oh yeah. Came home from the pool house from playing pool and sat down in his recliner and went yeah. to sleep. <laughs> T says, "Call nine one one. Carrie is missing." No, she's not. I was putting stuff away. Yeah. I can't do any more on my fish because I don't have a frame. We need to get a 5 by 7 okay. frame. So here's his tail, and I'm tucking it inside. I just, this is hemp cord. 
like butcher, like the uh, bakery twine, but it's made out of hemp. And I'm going to braid that. I'm just tucking the knot inside, and now I'm going to sew it shut. So the little turning section shut. Then I have to sew the ears on. Sew the ears on? Mm-hmm. Now, if I was... I'm really stubborn, and I was thinking about trying to sew this with the sewing machine. think it would work. And I guess maybe I'll try. Oh no, if I do that, you won't be able to see it either. Let me try moving this over. And switching to the overhead. Brennan Ferret says, I just came from Walfux. And, uh, or, or, well, T says Walfarks. I'm guessing she means Walmart. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, Grinnin Ferret says, uh, storm coming in this weekend, one to two feet, and negative numbers on the Sunday. Are you in northern Vermont, Grinnin Ferret? I'm going to step away real quick. Get some water. They only had one girl on the daily slicer. That's not good. Oh, come on. Southern Tier, okay. Near, okay, Birmingham, then. okay. Just do it. Oh, you can't even see what the hell I'm doing. I'm sorry, people. Not that you need to see this. It's just real rudimentary whip stitch. This me, yeah, I hate that when I smell snow. That's not a good thing.
Oh, wow. Mark's in the snow bit, too. Yeah. Well, they're saying it's supposed to be six degrees here tomorrow. And I got a, I got a thing I got to go to. Wait, we have four thumbs downs? Cool. <laughs> Do we really? Oh, well. Well, fuck them. Haters gonna hate. Yeah, and players gonna play. I mean, if you really hate us, why don't you just give us two thumbs down? Yeah, right? Hit it twice. Go ahead. See if we care. I don't give a shit. Yeah, like T says, counts as viewing activity. Yep. <sighs> okay. <laughs> She says, make my day, fuckers. <laughs> hey, we applaud the thumbs downs here. After all, <laughs> this is an adult show. If you're offended by shit we say, this show isn't for you. After all, we do this for us, people. Well, NT and Kim Marie and, you know, Mark and Roy and Grin and Ferret. We don't do it for you. All righty, there we go. One sewed up <laughs> moose. <laughs> Grin and Ferret says, don't know where their thumbs have been anyway. <laughs> Amen. 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 Wait, Grinning Ferret's 13? Oh, crap. Here we go. Oh, shit. We just dealt with this the other day. Please tell me you're not 13. No, seriously, please tell me you're not 13. <laughs> she says, no. <laughs> How many anniversaries of your 13th birthday have you had? <laughs> yeah. yeah. She's 13 at heart. There you go. Well, we're all 13 at heart. I beg your pardon. I'm all right, two. you're 14 and a half at heart. No, I'm two. <laughs> Sheesh. Oh, I like that little. Give it in the ear. It makes it look real. Mice don't have plaid ears. Well, sure they do. They do? In the 70s, they did. Oh, okay. Well, 50s. Everything was plaid in the 70s and polyester. Yeah. Leisure Suit Larry was king. Oh, God. I remember that video game, too. I love that game. That game was so cool. It was all I about him getting laid. It. Well, yeah, but I just, I like that kind of show, that kind of game. 
kind of like the precursor to mist. <coughs> You, know, you had to make them walk and do things. Yeah. Like, any game where the whole object of the game is to get some dude laid, that's a good game. If you say so. <laughs> Mark says, Melissa, you need to make a squirrel instead. A squirrel? Oh. <laughs> Grin and Ferret says, AARP sends me mail. <laughs> <laughs> me too. <laughs> hmm. oh, How do God. they know? Well, they buy your information from probably Social Security. Meh. Yep. Where the hell do ears go on the mouse? Anywhere I want to stick them? Yeah, pretty much. All right, that's where it's going. Roy says, great cult movie, Polyester by John Waters, starring Divine. I gotta say, I haven't seen that movie, but if it's John Waters, I'm in. I love John Waters. I should really find a thimble. And I know you can't see what I'm doing. I'm sorry. Yeah, we're trying. I'll switch to the other camera. Okay. We're trying. I think Roy should call in. Yeah, Roy, give us a call. 410-989-1734. There you go. What are you up to, Carrie? Five ten. <laughs> har har har. You win. Yeah, but I was expecting a real legitimate answer. Uh. Yeah. It's funny how that works out. <laughs> Roy says, Oh, thank you. Oh, come on. Oh, my finger is so sore. Stand still, Dagnabbit. Ah, Roy says, I'll give it some thought for next week. Getting ready to turn in. He's leaving. Okay. Roy. He's leaving early tomorrow. And Sandra says she gets coupons from Marlboro. And she's never smoked a day in her life. That's that. Uh, they should be. That should be illegal. You know, I heard something today from one of the uh, people I work with stating that Philip Morris has stated they're going to stop making tobacco products by the year twenty twenty. Mm. I don't believe it. Mm -mm. What well, what would they turn to? What else would they turn to? Vaping. 
They own yeah, but Juul. If it's nicotine, it's still tobacco product. No, it's not, Mother. Nicotine and tobacco are two separate things. Okay. Tomatoes have nicotine in them. Do they? Yeah, they do. A gr grin and ferret says weed. Weed. Oh, yeah, there you go. There's the next yeah, market. They got plenty of fields. Well, yeah, they've got fields ready to start growing. Yeah. As a matter of fact, when Marlboro comes out with Marlboro Blue, you know it's weed. What's Marlboro? Marlboro Blue is weed? Yes. It's I not out. Men uh, no, no. The menthols are green. Are yeah, they? green. Um, uh, no, uh, Marlboro Blue is supposed to be a weed product that they're going to be putting out uh, when it becomes... Uh, yeah, and how many... Uh unnecessary chemicals will that be treated with oh probably yeah. 1349 give or take it'll be one percent susan ernst is here hell she says hello everyone hello there susan how are you thank you for joining us i am making a stuffed mouse mm -hmm. Sandra says, no wonder I crave tomatoes. <laughs> <laughs> See, I crave tomatoes because they're delicious. You give me tomatoes, salt, and mayonnaise, and I've got a sandwich. Yep, me too. Oh, up here in the hills, they call it an M&M. Matters and mayo. Yeah, there you go. Just take a slice of white bread out to your garden, smear it with mayo, and slap a tomato on there. That sounds delicious. Doesn't it? Yes, that's why I just said it sounds delicious. Even Doesn't Sandra it? says, they are delicious. I love me some garden meters. Yeah, sounds like me, Care. Getting, that time mighty, right? getting mighty tired. Then again, Carrie and I have been up since four and five. We're pretty tired. <laughs> Sandra says, add some bacon and lettuce and I'm sold. Well, oh, yeah. I think oh, yeah. everyone, including vegans, would be sold on that. I mean, I'm sorry, bacon? Yeah. Hell yeah. Bacon's good. We don't have any bacon in the house, do we? Mm -mm. Why is I just that? Used, I just used mine up. I made fried cabbage and bacon. Oh, damn. Damn, is that good. I took it over to the Rotens. How are they? Oh, they're doing great. They're good. doing great. How's Maya? Maya is going gonna, is gonna to be 16 on the 23rd. That's scary. And Kyler is 14. Um, Tucker is, I think, almost 13. No. Yeah, no, maybe maybe 13. They're growing so quick. That's and what's so Ethan, scary. Ethan's going to be... He's what, 14? Uh, no, Ethan is the youngest, and he's oh, 11, I think. 11, okay. Tu Tucker's birthday is July 17th. No! Yes! That's did you tell them that that's also my birthday? Yes, I did. That's crazy. Yep. Well, hell, maybe I'll have to take a vacation week and come on uh come on down there and and celebrate uh Tucker's birthday with him. Yeah. They're such good kids. Yeah. If you guys don't know, uh the Roten family is uh is down in North Carolina with mom. And uh, they are very good friends of mom, and they're just really damn good people. I've basically adopted them. And uh, I I can't imagine my life without them in it. Yeah. They are just so awesome. So. Okay, T says, toast the wheat bread, add ketchup, cheese, lettuce, and bacon. Yummy. See, I can do without the ketchup. I'm not a ketchup fan. Because you're weird. No, I mean I don't, don't 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 get me wrong. I like ketchup where it's applicable. Applicable? Applicable. I said it right, Ma. 
Don't give me I, shit. I, I was just saying the word. <laughs> Sand- oh. <laughs> Sandra said, <laughs> fuck you, dear. <laughs> Sandra says, when's your birthday? It's July 17th. Thank you very much. Tonight's July 29th. Mine's before yours. Yes, yours is February yes. 12th. February 12th, coming up. 1982. 82. <laughs> give There's or take. no way I am younger than you are. Give or, give or take. Why am I having such problems with this? Uh, My thumb is killing me. I split it. Oh, that's no good. And it hurts. Oh, don't even give me any shit, Ma. Look at this. Hold on. Mm. Oh, will you stop whining? What did you do? I took it. Well, you can't see it because. Hold on. There yeah. you go. There you go. Yeah, yeah. I took. I I was using my exacto blade, and uh, Idiot. It, it it bit me. It bit me. I don't know what what happened here, but this thing just kind of it split. Mm. Look. Oh, look at that! Sandra's January thirty first. Oh, almost birthday time for you. Yeah, happy birthday, Sandra. Happy a little bit early. To, to you. you. Happy, happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy, happy birthday, birthday to Sandra. Okay, uh, enough of that. Susan is July 26th. Hey! Well, there you go. Susan is July 26th. Kelly, is, my son, is July 28th. Mom is July 29th. Um, Dad is what, August 12th? August 11th. 11th. Okay. Yay. Ooh, Sandra's going to do a live stream on her birthday. Sandra, because I'm an idiot, can you please t um, send me a message on Facebook when you're you know, going to go live so I can watch you? She goes live every Friday at 9.30 Pacific Standard Time. A.M. or P.M.? A.M. So Well, I'm at work then. Out. Yeah, that's the problem. Well, fuck! How am I supposed to watch you when I'm at work? You have to think about these things, Sandra. Still <laughs> YouTube! <laughs> Hey, I tried to stealth solitaire one day, and they caught me. God, did they really? Yeah, yeah. Oh dear. Yeah, my boss came to me and says, "You, you, you like to just sit there and do nothing." And I'm like, "No, I like to sit there and fucking learn." And he's like, "Yeah, well, you need to stop playing solitaire." And I'm like, "You need to teach me." When you said none of that, I I, I said none of that. No, <laughs> I did. I, I I said none of that. You are not Carrie. <laughs> well, no, they've they they like for the first two weeks they had me sitting there, like they had me split my time between working on the fee in the field with a coworker, which is amazing. Like working with my coworker is awesome because he's awesome, and then you know sitting at the office watching uh, sis admin do his thing and not teach me anything because oh I'm not going to be doing that, so it's not applicable applicable. And Why so are you I, watching? Yeah, so I'm sitting there watching him move his mouse a, mi a million miles a minute because that's how he works. Like, if he doesn't know what he's clicking, he sits there and moves the mouse and scrolls up and down. And it's like, it's funny to watch him because you know he's thinking, oh, oh, where is it? Where is it? Where? Oh, there it is. Oh, where is it? Where is it? Where? Oh, there it is. So it's it's funny. But, like, he even said, it's like, well, you're not going to be doing this, so there's no point in you watching. So it's like, what the fuck am I supposed to do? Sandra's sister is July 26th as well. Cool beans. T is May 25th, and she expects a crap load of presents. Although she later said that she was kidding, but I doubt it. Oh, for the love of God. <laughs> I don't know why I'm having so 
problems with this. I am not of the knowing. So here's a fun story. Today I was in a, uh, a, a retail environment that yet was not to open. And uh, they were testing the electricity. And so they, were, they flipped the breakers on the lights and all the lights went out. And you know what I said? What happened? Aziz! Lights! Lights! <laughs> and then about five minutes later, they flipped the breakers back in. Thank you. And I was in the middle of a conversation with someone else at the time. And just instinctively, as the lights went on, I stopped saying what I was in the middle of saying and said, Thank you, Aziz. Thank you, Aziz. Great. <laughs> Much better. I don't I don't think anyone in the room got what I was talking about, but it Probably made not. it made sense to me, therefore it was funny. Sanjay laughs. Sanjay yes. says that. <laughs> Does he really? Yeah, Aziz light. That's funny. Thank you, Aziz. Much better. Roy says, just put one ear on and call it Mouse Van Gogh. <laughs> that's actually a damn good idea. Just one big ear on the top. Yeah, that's, that's, well, you've already got two already, so you're, yeah. you're you know, you're past that point. I could, I could make creeple mice. Oh, God, oh, no. Oh, God. People love it, your creeples. I know. Grin and Ferret says, Battle Mouse. Battle Mouse. Yes. Battle Mouse. Ooh, what are you doing? Ooh. Mm, just doodling. Because I'm too tired to do anything that takes real thought. <laughs> well, if you're tired and I'm tired... That makes us really... Doesn't mean I want to go to bed. No, I never said go to bed. What she said. Yeah, exactly. I am surrounded by talented artists. Ooh, Susan just ate rice. Might I ask what type of rice? Was it Thai rice? Asian rice? Basmati rice. Oh, God, I love basmati. It's the only rice. It's not the only rice, Mother. It's just the only good one. That's not true. Yeah, I know it's not true. Oh, come on for some number. Where are we going? <sighs> We're going to go check in on Carrie. So since when do you make snowflakes? Uh, this has been lurking around for oh, a while. I thought okay. you killed snowflakes, not made them. Yeah. <laughs> we take the heat gun to snowflakes. Ha <laughs> ha. <sighs> Susan says white. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Two to one ratio of wa uh, water and rice. Twenty what? minutes on the burner. Yeah, it's good stuff. Twice as much water as rice. Rinse your rice. First. Yes, that's what I said. Rinse. I said two to one ratio. Mm -mm. It is the same thing. You didn't hear what I said. I said rinse the no, rice. No, I heard that. Rinse it until it's clear. Then. Add twice as much water as rice. Bring to a boil. Put on low. Cover. Don't touch for 20 minutes. Oh. Well, that ear looks deformed. I don't think Dinky's going to care much. I mean, it's clearly, <laughs> yeah, I don't think he's going to care much either. <laughs> if it's you a... really want to want no evidence left, send it here and I'll have two pit bulls put it out of its misery in about right. two minutes. 
You think it would take yeah. that long? I think it would take about 20 seconds. It would seconds. take about two minutes because we would hand it to Lincoln, Lucy would grab it, growl at him, and then <laughs> run off with it. <laughs> mm. Poor little mouse would never have a chance. <laughs> no, of course not. So, Ma, what are you up to this weekend? Uh, I have to go to a uh, Sweet 16. Oh, who? For- for Maya. Tomorrow. Oh, Maya, yes, of course. I know Maya won't watch this show, so I can talk about it, because uh, it's adult-related. And uh, the rodents don't don't use that type of vocabulary. No. They make water. They don't take a leak. They're proper. So, um, so tomorrow is her sweet 16th birthday. She thinks, or sweet 16 party. She thinks that, um, Evan is taking her out, um, on a kind of like a date, a dad and daughter date. Oh, that's cute. To a, to a fancy restaurant. So she's got a fancy dress. She's got fancy shoes. Nice. Uh, Can you do me a favor? What? Tell her that Carrie and I say happy birthday. I will. I will. Because we I haven't got... seen her since she was, what, 13? I've never met her. We were there once when they were there. No, I don't think so. The last time we were there, Evan and the family came over for dinner, remember? No, they didn't. Am I just delusional? or? Did... Yes, yes, you, you are. are. Okay, well... They did not come in July. Okay, all right, well, the last time... Well, no. Uh, a couple times ago, I was there. They came over yeah, for dinner. You may have been there. Well, I thought you were there too because I was talking to you so much on the phone. I don't know. But yes. All right. Well, fine. Please tell her I said happy birthday. See, I'm not really here right now. I'm just a figment of your imagination. Except the fact that you're on camera. Mm hmm. You're in a padded room somewhere hugging yourself very tightly. Well, that might be the case, but the other people see you on camera. It's all in your head, honey. It's not in my head if the other people see you on camera. They're in your head, too. (laughs) Well, I I think Mark is in my head the most. (laughs) And T. And, And, you know. Yeah, that's what a pit bull does when they're excited. Holy crap. Ouch. Yes. The 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 joys of having a pit bull. Now I was playing with Lucy and next thing I know she went into I'm gonna get you mode and she got me. Yeah. Yeah, I got a cat that does that. <laughs> Shelly says, I don't see anything. <laughs> yeah. Shelly, why you gotta play why you gotta play sides? <laughs> like you don't have to play on her team all the time. I'm here too, and I have eyes. I'm just saying that's that's it. You're delusional. Yes, three demonic scratches, Grin. You got that right. Yeah, for okay. our pits, um, the Lincoln enjoys a good Nyla bone. He can. They last him a good while. Nyla um, bones last him at least a month, at least, if not more. Uh, Lucy will tolerate a Nyla bone because can't find anything else for her to play with. She likes stuffed animals, and she was really good with them when she was a puppy, but she watched him destroy one, so now she figures that's what she has to do when she gets one. So we don't do that anymore. Yeah. And he still has toys that he hasn't seen in like four years because we well, they know. they can't share. They I know. I know. Yeah. <sighs> we know that if we bring out the toys, like they will fight. Uh, like they he's will. He's got a Nyla bone, I swear to you, I could knock somebody out with. It's huge. Absolutely huge. But we can't. Oh yeah, I know that one. We we haven't brought that out since the day we bought it yeah. or brought it because it's just they fight over it. <laughs> and I don't mean fight as in like 
Grr. I mean, like, I will fuck you uh, up, motherfucker. Yeah, they, they go into aggressive pity mode, and it's like, ugh. Yeah. They sleep on top of each other. Like, Lucy has been known to lay on top of Lincoln. Like, you know, well, that they're, dog. They're always cuddled up together. Yeah, but you you put a <gasps> Nyla bone in the mix, and it's like, I will cut you, bitch. <laughs> well, it's like, Lincoln will actually play, like, fetch. You throw it, he'll bring it back. He's really, he's always done it. It's yeah. not anything we ever had to teach him. He just instinctively does it. Her, on the other hand, you throw it, she gets it, she lays down and chews on uh-huh. it. Uh-huh. And so try and play with him, keep him active, keep his hip moving, and she'll, like, trot after him a few times, and then when she's finally had enough of him running around, she'll grab him by the back leg, growl, <laughs> make him drop the bow, take She's runs. She's drawn blood. <laughs> we'll just say that. She has drawn blood. Oh, good lord. <laughs> what? What's CJ, CJ says, come on, PJ, admit it. You've got a little too, you got a little too passionate with Carrie last night. Okay. If he did, I was unconscious, and I, I have no memory of that. Let me take a minute to address this uh, topic with the, 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 the Cranky Crafters crew, <laughs> as I've so passionately called you guys. Um, I wish... <laughs> That I had the opportunity to get passionate or too passionate with Carrie last night. As it was, I passed the hell out because I was that exhausted. And Carrie, as you were too grumpy and out of sorts, I was. You I needed was. To go in a corner somewhere. Hey, I try to like diffuse the situation, but sometimes I just need to just say, screw it, I'm turning off. I, I literally turn my phone off. Like, that's when you know it's really bad in my head. I turn my phone off because I couldn't take the blinging of emails and text messages. I'm like, no, I'm done. I just couldn't do it. <laughs> T says, Carrie lo- no longer puts out. She married him. <laughs> well, no, that stopped before we got married. Yeah. And he's still dumb enough to marry me. Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty fucking dumb. <laughs> and yes, uh, darn it, I don't remember her name. Dirty Pink Brush. Uh, yes. Kim. If you, what? Kim? Or Kim. We'll call her Gloria. No, Kim. Uh, One Kim. Every time we get up, they hop right where we were because it's warm, and then you gotta fight with them. Yeah. To get them to move. They're oh, yeah. constantly taking over. Hey, Lincoln! He's like, what? Hi! Hi, Dad. They're trying Come here. to sleep. Come here. There's the old man. Hello, puppy. Mm. He's nothing but loves. Nothing but loves. Uh oh! Here comes the jealous one. Hello, Goosey. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Rape, rape, rape. Get him, poot. Get Me him too. Get him, poot. Me too. Get him, poot. She said, "Enough of you." <laughs> it's doing pretty girl. Oh, what's mommy? She put doing? her tongue directly in my That's mouth. That's my girl. Ew. She says it's the best way to do it. <laughs> the dirty paintbrush, or Kim says, OMG, she is gorgeous. Yeah, she's pretty fucking hot. Yeah, she knows she's pretty, too. Yeah, she's a supermodel. What you smelling, Miss Poot? Oh, uh, you gotta smell that. Okay. One mouth. Put your face over this way. She's hitting the mic and everything. <laughs> what you doing? Huh? What you gonna make? Hmm? What you gonna make? While we're taking this time to take a look at my dog's brown ass... <laughs> yep. I will uh, remind you guys that if you guys want to check out some beads that Carrie made, you can go to epiphanycraft.com slash shop and uh, check that out. Just saying. Hello, foot. Yes, she is full grown. She was the. Um, she was the runt of the litter that actually lived. Yes, she because was, the runt died. Yeah, she was the next one up. And we still call her a rescue because she is. 
Yep, she's yeah, got she was cowfoot. definitely rescued. Cowfoot? Yeah. Mom, do you want to explain the situation that she lived in? Um, let's see. <laughs> Being that she was your uh, niece? Or, wait. And your cousin. Um, well, yeah, cousin. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, she, she took after my mother. Uh, she, well, my mother was a drunk, but my brother was a drunk, and his daughter is a heroin addict. Well, was. Well, was, but who she's knows still a fuck on now. She's still a, f uh, well, wow, I was about to say something really, something stupid. She oh. is a fuck T. How about that? Because I can't, oh, what? I can't say the T word. Oh, what? yeah, yeah. Twat. Yeah, she's a fuck twat. There you go. Okay, uh, there you go. Well, Lucy spent the first six months of her life, no. or six weeks of her life, in a cage. CJ says that this looks like the one that ran across her floor lately. <laughs> he has no eyeballs. Yeah, oh. Lucy weighs anywhere from like 45 to 50, 52. <laughs> Uh, Kim says, what? I love the word fucktwat. That's <laughs> not the word I wanted to use, it, but the last time I it used works. any... It works. It does work, but the last time I used any ah, type ah, of... Ah, ah, ah. Every type of compound ah. of that word that I used, I get in trouble. Fucktwat, so don't use it. That's why I'm not using it. Fucktwat. I like the word fucknugget. Fucknugget is awesome. Fucktwat. I came up with that. I was pissed off at Sanjay once, and it, I just said fucknugget. <laughs> It. T says twat waffle. Fuckity fuck fuck. Oh god, not the blue waffle. <laughs> Grin and ferret says my polite word is monkey nuts. <laughs> monkey nuts. See, T knows what I was trying to say. T gets me. I love T. Alright, if you're not gonna make something, what are you doing, Pooh? She's being there. she's being the star. Being the star, letting everybody look at your butt, your big brown butt, big brown butt. You look very sleepy. You sleepy. <laughs> Kim says, "Twan waffle is good." Oh my god! That's <laughs> right, CJ. An addict is never cured. They will always fight the battle. Yep. Yeah, and I have no qualms about it. I'm an addict. I need to get my hair cut. Which is why I don't touch certain substances. I need to cut my hair, Miss Poo Poo. Kim says, I made up the phrase cum satchel. Cum satchel? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord, oh, Lord. Jesus oh. Christ. What part? Yeah. There's a reason I don't have Yankee candles in this house because I'm a Yankee candle addict. Even though I don't have them in the house, I'm always a Yankee Candle addict. Not me. I can't handle synthetic smells. I like to get it nice and melty and then inject it. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I would never do that. I snort it. <sighs> Everyone loves it. It has to be a good word for a container. Satchel made sense. Yeah, no, cum satchel is very fucking funny. <clears throat> oh, my head is clogged. Well, at least you haven't been like blowing out blood clots in your nose every morning. No, I did that the other day. I've been doing that every day this week. I blow my mm. nose when I go. Like I wait, I wake up. I go take a dump. And I, while I'm taking a dump, I blow my nose, and it just comes out blood. And then I have to stick a piece of paper towel or toilet paper up my freaking nose. We don't need to hear about... Yeah, but I'm going to tell you accidents. anyway. I have to live with it. Nobody else needs to be tortured by it. No, Kim, I don't snort ass. I lick <sighs> ass. There's oh, a difference. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Hey, I don't hear you complaining. Sure you do. <laughs> right, Poodle Poot. I'm still waiting for someone to call in and be like, hey. Yes, Kim, I went there. 
<laughs> yeah, I think I think one big ear like a satellite dish would work. Well, that makes sense. <sighs> well, Sandra, the Mia Bella stuff that you, is that the stuff you sent us? Because I I've been so busy and so wrapped up with work, I haven't actually had a chance to light it. But I have got it upstairs, right, sitting right next to the tea light. So I think I'm gonna have to light it tomorrow morning. I've got to go to the ATM tomorrow morning. I've got to get some cash out. That's if I allow you to use my vehicle. Well, if I if I can't use your vehicle, I'm gonna use the work vehicle. Will you get in trouble for that? I don't know. Probably not. Do they have... Uh... Probably. They probably have tracking on it. But see, here's the thing. Loss prevention and field services or maintenance department takes, uh, you know, takes control of all of the... Uh, all of the uh, the GPS monitoring of the vehicles. But see, we're not a part of field services or maintenance. We're a part of IT. So, like, they don't talk to each other. So I could probably drive my vehicle to, like, I don't know, Wyoming, and they wouldn't know it. Kim Marie says, Lucy is so sweet. Yeah, sometimes. Other times she acts like me and not so much. She's a rapey cunt sometimes. That she doesn't get from me. Unfortunately. <laughs> I'm a good girl. <laughs> T says she sure is a uh, she sure is for a killer pit bull bad rep puppers. Yep. Ay 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 ay. Puppy cam. Puppy cam. Studio cam. Okay. What are you what are you doing? Well, my glass bottle. It's such a pretty bottle. Yeah. It is a pretty color. Have a great night, Sandra. Night, Sandra. Good night, Sandra. Yeah. T says careful, they'll take your heart and not your arm. God damn it. Arm. I have hiccups. Yeah, I had them last night. There we go. Yeah, they're gonna eat my face all right. Um, 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 Yes, you do. You've got the lockjaw. Oh, my God. Lockjaw. Yeah, that's like, they have like... Uh, I know, yeah. honey. That's just not... Yep. I have to say, though, pit bulls are my favorite breed. Just because they're the under, the literal underdog. Okay, you're sitting there. Pretty like... Sitting there all pretty like... Hello, Goose Goose. A little sad face. Look at that tail wagon. You don't know that you're on camera, do you? Yes, she does. <gasps> yes, you do? No, you don't. <gasps> <laughs> Look at that tail wagon. I love it. <laughs> I love it. I do. I love it. <laughs> Uh-oh. Lincoln's coming back up again. He's jealous. Oh, you... Well, no. She's jealous. She, like, he will walk away when, the instant that Lucy comes up and says, hey, I want some. But She's see, that's, sitting there being good. Yeah. Usually when, uh, when Lincoln's getting some loves like he is right now, Lucy will come up jumping and says, hey, fuck you, I want some. 
It's just proving you wrong. You're getting old, man. Hey, you know, hey. Lincoln's birthday was yesterday. Was it really? Yeah. How, How old does old that make him? Uh, negative 11 teens. Yeah. I shall tell you in a moment. Oh. We got Lincoln from Barks, which is a Baltimore area animal rescue or something. I don't know. Uh, da, 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 da. I don't. I don't know. There it is. Kim Marie says, I love how they sit. Do they Superman lay down on the floor? Yes. Lucy does not, yeah. but Lincoln does. Yes, she does. I've Really? I, yeah. I've always called that the frog. Yeah. His ears are really crooked. That sounds like my dog. <laughs> but see, my dog had like $2,000 worth of surgery to get his ears crooked. He is nine. No, he is not. He is nine. Is we he got really? him in 2010, and he was six months old when we got him. Oh, my God. So. You know, we have to get him some like really big bones with marrow and everything. Because we didn't get him anything for his birthday. Because we're fuck, uh, we're idiots. Fuck twats. Yeah, we're fuck twats. There you go. That's the new mildly more acceptable version of my word. Oh, I forget that you can't see my screen. <laughs> well, I can fix that if you'd uh, if you'd open OBS. All right. Yes. Mm, yes. It's running. Okay. This is when we first got him, when you all can see it. Uh, and he was still getting healed up from having Demodex, but that picture just makes him look <laughs> <laughs> He's like, what Poor you talking thing. about, Willis? Yeah. And this is him at six months old. I mean, this is day one. We took this picture the first day. No, we, oh, what? No, really? No. Oh, okay. There you go. Oh, look at the poor thing. Yeah. He was badly abused. Uh, Baltimore Animal Rescue, uh, they, they, they pulled him from a house in Baltimore City where he was chained to a pole so tightly that he couldn't get away from his own feces. And he had mange, and he was emaciated to the point where we saw all of his ribs. Like, he was abused. He was badly abused. He still has scars on his forehead from where he was beat. And this is him a month later. <laughs> yeah, Kim Marie says, God, I hate people. And yeah, this is why we don't yeah. want to go to grocery stores. Like, we hate people to the point where we can't even go out in public anymore. We're coming, we're becoming recluse. Is. And daddy did that to his picture. Yeah, I had to. <laughs> I just had to. It was Easter time. <laughs> but he's my baby boy. Yeah, Kim says, people all assholes. Yeah, they are. Yeah. Yes, and he does have his own Facebook page. Don't judge me. <laughs> Actually, was it you that said I up? did it. Okay, okay. I wasn't sure because I would have set it up if you didn't. And he no one studied... said anything to him for a year. He studied walking with Alicia at University of Life. <laughs> he went to school of hard knocks. <laughs> oh, he doesn't live in Manchester. No, no, I haven't logged in and updated it in yeah. years. <laughs> It's funny that, you know, the, the city that he was taken from, he's now living in, and he's completely yeah. happy. He's got his own backyard with a fence, and he's just loving it. And he likes Cyronic and Breaking Benjamin. And you see movies he likes, right? <laughs> <laughs> 
Lassie. <laughs> Frazier. Because of uh, Eddie. Eddie. Of Rin course. Tin Tin. The dog whisperer. <laughs> and he loves Blue Clue, Blue's Clues. Mm -hmm. Yep. Let be that. Ah, yes. <sighs> so, Mom, show us what you've been into. Whoops, wrong screen, motherfucker. Eh, there you go. All right, show us what you've done. I made a drunk blind. <laughs> um, oh, I love that tale. I do. Yeah. I love that tale. <laughs> So there he is. He doesn't have any eyeballs. He doesn't have a nose. But I think that's fine. Well, the more eyeballs and noses he has, the more shit that uh, Dinky is going to be able to rip off. Exactly. But as far as I'm concerned, I, I'm really thinking I have to do creeples. Oh, joy. So I don't know if I do like one big ear on the top. <laughs> Like a radar dish? <laughs> <laughs> or hell, just put a literal radar dish on his head. Well, no, these are supposed to be cat toys, so it would have to be one big ear, and it may be like one big eye. I don't know. I'll have to think. Mm. I will have to think. My Rosie is from um, a shelter. Yeah. Yeah, we got her when she was four and a half, and she's um, 11 and a half now. Oh, look at that. Grin and Ferret's poodle was from a shelter, too. Dinka will love him. Yeah, I'll take him back there and see how he likes it. Yeah. Can I, I make a request? What? On the next episode of Cranky Crafters, can you have Dinky as a uh, an in-house guest? Um, wow, that I would love to, but he would destroy this place. Oh, okay. Oh, Mark's off to work. Have a good night, y'all. Uh, good night, Mark. Have a good night. Be safe on the roads. Mark Good night. It was great Rosie having you. doesn't really play with toys, Sanjay. You know that. <laughs> she has her tug monkey upstairs, and she doesn't play with it. Uh, that sounded slightly dirty. Tug monkey. Oh, well, it's a monkey that's got really long legs and arms that go through holes in its body. Yeah. So hey. that they can, you know, tug, tug, tug. Hey, honey. Tug toy. Will you play with the tug monkey later? No. Damn it! <laughs> um, I wouldn't want to put buttons on it because I'd be afraid that they would pull off the buttons. I mean, I could sew it on real strong, I guess, but um, I'm still waiting for Spanky to send me an invoice for a bag of buttons, but I haven't gotten it yet. Uh -huh. so I, have to, I need to find some buttons, but buttons, I guess, would be a good a good idea. Speaking of shipment confirmations, I think we might have something being shipped out soon. Oh. And that's as much as I'm going to say, <laughs> Carrie. What? You said you weren't talking about it. <laughs> All right. All right, Carrie. Mm. What did you do tonight? Tried to take over the world. Nah. What did you do? Let's see what you done. Yeah, do. like that's what I'm trying to get her to do, but she's I tried being... to take over the world. That's all. I made a fish. You made a fish. That's pretty. That was very pretty. And he sparkles a little bit. Speaking of the fish, uh, we will have the fish as a stencil in an no, upcoming... Why not? Because I'm not making it into a stencil. It's three pieces. Yeah, we should have a full sheet that has a stencil that is a three-piece for the fish, and then some coral or something. Oh, man. So, <laughs> Carrie... Sanjay wants me to use kibble as buttons. That would uh, not last very long, but that would be a very good investment. But anyway, so Carrie will be uh, releasing her uh, her her uh, her fish as a stencil uh, on the Epiphany Craft web shop. 
sometime soon. That's all. That's as much as I can say. But she's going to be putting that on front of her um, her her uh, alcohol ink thing that she made. And she's, thing about bobble. Yes. That the, thing. Yes. Uh, here, let me uh, get that in the frame. What the hell? Stop that! There. Pick the camera. There, that one. Yeah, she's that going one. to be putting the fish on top of that. And then framing it so it uh, adds dimension to it. Very cool. Aw, T says, I have to goo. <laughs> Thanks for tolerating me. Well, we would, oh, T. We would, you're not something to tolerate. We enjoy having you. If I wasn't such a slacker, I'd have a theme song for you already. Like, you're that awesome. I don't even have a theme song. <laughs> There's T leaving. Well, you know, that's, again, because I'm a slacker. Now, it's not good. You know, I'm not even going to blame that anymore. Like, I have too much shit going on in my life to do stuff. But, uh, you know, I'll get to it sooner or later. I just have to write the lyrics and the words and, or l lyrics and the music, rather, and uh, we'll go from there. T says, Carrie does it best. <laughs> yes, which is why I love sleeping with her. Really? Ha 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 ha. Anyway. Alright. So are we gonna get out of here for this evening? You are. Yeah. Alright, well, let me, uh... Shit. Um... What? Did you break things? No, I didn't break things. I just... There you go. Alright, so... I'm just working with stuff. All right, so we are going to get out of here, folks. Uh, it has been uh, great hanging with you this Friday evening, and uh, we, we've loved it. It's been awesome. So, uh, hey, don't forget you can get your own paper beads uh, made by Carrie over at the... <laughs> yeah, let me try that again. At epiphanycraft.com slash shop. Yeah, again, that's Craft. Dot com slash shop. All right, uh, we're going to get out of here, like I said earlier. Be sure to drop a thumb on tonight's video. Uh, subscribe and ring our bell for notifications. Share this video to spread the love. And until next week, we've been Cranky Crafters. Later, Tater. Later. Bye, Flockers. See ya.